Hello, and thank you for joining me this morning. My name is Dallas with Motivation Station, and today we are going to talk about weight loss motivation. Uh, but before we get into weight loss motivation, be sure you hit that subscribe button below because we post new weight loss motivation videos every single day. Also, be sure to watch this video all the way to the end because I'm going to share with you a secret formula that will help target that deep, stubborn belly fat. Uh, first thing is you need to know why you want to lose the weight in the first place. Is it for health reasons, to get ready for a beach trip, to help you fit in the clothes again? Think of as many reasons as you can of why you want to lose the weight. Then you're going to write them down. Read them every morning as soon as you wake up and before you go to bed. This will help you stay motivated for weight loss. Have realistic expectations when setting your weight loss goals. What I mean by that is don't expect to lose 20 pounds in a week. It's not going to happen it's, and it's not healthy to lose that much weight that fast. Uh, but if you wanted to lose 30 pounds in three months, that's realistic. Uh, now let's talk about setting weight loss goals and details. First, we need to determine exactly how much weight you want to lose altogether. Then determine an exact date you want to lose it by. For example, again, if you want to lose 30 pounds, it'll probably take about three months to realistically hit that goal. So we're going to set monthly, weekly, and daily goals to help keep our weight loss motivation up. Let's break it down. 30 pounds in three months, that's 10 pounds a month um, for the monthly goal. So that would be 10 pounds. Our weekly goal is about two and a half pounds a week. That's not too bad. Uh, with our daily goals, we're going to plan out exactly what we're going to do every day in advance to help keep us on track to hit our weight loss goals. For example, if you plan on running or walking, plan out exactly how long you're going to run that day. Uh, or if you plan on going to the gym, plan out exactly what you plan on working that day. For this example, uh, you could do full body workout one day and then another day you would just do cardio, like cycling, running, walking, etc. Also, you got to plan out your meals. Find health foods that you'll like. Um, for me, it's chicken. I love chicken. It's low in fat and high in protein. Uh, just make sure it's not fried. Fried chicken is not a very good choice. Um, if you're looking for some ideas, if you look in the description below, there's a cookbook. It's called Fast Fat Burning Meals. Uh, this will help keep you help you with some ideas for meals. Um, make sure you pick a plan that fits into your lifestyle. Find a plan you can stick to and avoid plans that would be impossible to stick to. Make sure you start keeping a weight loss journal. Self-monitoring is crucial to weight loss motivation and success. Research has found that people who track their food intake are more likely to lose weight and maintain their weight loss. However, to keep a food journal correctly, you must write down everything you eat. So if you have a piece of candy, write that down. Anything you eat, make sure you write it down. Uh, you can also record your emotions in your food journal. This can help you identify certain triggers for overeating and help you find healthier ways to cope. Next, celebrate your successes. Losing weight is hard, so celebrate all your successes to help keep your weight loss motivation up. Give yourself some credit when you accomplish a goal. When you feel pride in yourself, it will increase your motivation. People need regular support and positive feedback to stay motivated. So please feel free to post your success in the comments below. Um, we can celebrate with you and we can help keep you on track. 
You can even share your weight loss goals with us. I'd love to hear about your accomplishments. So like I said, please share in the comments. Um, and also any ideas that have worked for you, put them in the comments. Research shows those who make public commitments are more likely to follow through with their weight loss goals. So make a commitment right here, right now, in the comments below. Next, you need to think and talk positively. People who have positive expectations and feel confident in their ability to achieve their goals tend to lose more weight. Spend a few minutes and imagine reaching your goal weight. What are you going to look like? How is it going to feel to put that pair of jeans on that you haven't been able to put on since high school? Just picture yourself being where you want to be. Then spend a few minutes thinking of any possible obstacles that may stand in your way. We need to plan for challenges and setbacks. Everyday stressors will happen. Find ways to plan for them and develop it proper coping skills no matter what life throws at you. How are you going to deal with the stress? Maybe try exercise, take a bath, maybe go for a walk outside. Whatever you do, find a way to help de-stress yourself. You do not have to be perfect to lose weight. So if you have an all or nothing approach, you're less likely to achieve your goals. Instead, forgive yourself if you mess up. Self-defeating thoughts just hinder your motivation. Learn to love and appreciate your body. Research has repeatedly found that people who dislike their bodies are less likely to lose weight. Find an exercise you love. For example, if you love to dance, then try learning some dancing and if you have a dog, you could go for a walk or run with your dog. I believe you can and will reach your weight loss goals. And please share with us all your accomplishments in the comments so we can all cheer you on. And like I said at the beginning of the video, if you stuck through until the end, I would share with you the secret formula of an ancient Japanese target tonic that targets the root cause of deep belly fat. So if you look in the description below, you will find a link that has this secret formula. Thank you again, and be sure to stay tuned tomorrow for more weight loss motivation. Thank you.